little ditty going earlier but before I got the chance to commit it to memory my fellow singers wandered off they'll be around town somewhere two of them there were fancy helping out with the reunion mm -mm. Mm -hmm. the woods shall wave on mountains and grass beneath the sun Shall be upholden, his harp shall be restrung, his halls shall echo golden to songs of yours. Dragons going to drag on for Is this everyone? Thank you so much for rounding them all up. I promise you, once you hear this song, you'll know it was worth the effort. The king beneath the mountains, the king of carven stone, the lord of silver fountains shall come into his own. The woods shall wave on mountains and grass beneath the sun. His wealth shall flow in fountains and rivers golden run. His crown shall be upholden, his harp shall be restrung, his halls shall echo golden to songs of your resung. The stream shall run in gladness, and the light shall shine and burn. All sorrow, fail, and sadness, and the mountain kings return. Again. I've got fish coming out of my ears. How long is this? Drag on for. has been a little low in this town of late. My father used to tell me stories of a yodeling shield that had the power to raise even the most sunken of spirits. If you'd be kind enough to find it for me, I think it could be just what we need. <laughs> oh my! Is that the yodeling shield? That is rather droll. <laughs> it did make me laugh though. I suppose it did the job. Hopefully it'll cheer my husband up too. He was mumbling earlier about something he'd lost. Maybe you could help him out if you see him. What should I name my boat? Is Boaty too obvious?
pretty too obvious. Mm hmm. How long is this talk of dragons going to? Word on the pier is that a group of travelers have designs on breaking into Erebor. Sounds like madness to me as well as a guaranteed way of waking an angry dragon. If that beast decides to go on a rampage, I plan to be prepared to defend Lake Town with my trusty ballista. That is, uh, if I get round to building it, maybe you could help. I've seen. But as they say, any port in a burning storm of dragonfire. Here, take this for your trouble. I thought maybe the Mirkwood air had drifted downstream and I was imagining it, but no. Goblins have actually stolen our boats. Look at them, riding around there without a care in the world. My aim is terrible, but someone needs to knock those cheeky beggars into the water and teach them a lesson. How do you like those apples, you boorish boat burglars? Ah, oh, thank you for that. It was worth having my boat stolen just to see those goblins get plunged into the water. <laughs> now, to see what the damage is. Come get your fish. Cook them. Mm-hmm. 
Crabs. I got all your fresh crabs right here. Yo ho ho and a bottle of summit. I quite like your piratey swing. Yeah, yeah, I know. I ain't got the best singing voice. Tell you what though, someone maybe that swing I mentioned. I'll be much too busy having fun to bother myself singing.
I gave my son a firefly jar to ease his fear of the dark. However, I've not seen him with it since we passed by Thranduil's kingdom a while ago. He's probably too proud to admit he's lost it. If you're in the area any time soon, would you mind having a look around for it? Thank you. My son puts on a brave face, but I believe we could all use something to brighten our days in these dark times. Those little fireflies are so cute. Hello again. Now that the cheery yodeling of that funny little shield has perked me up, I'm ready for a challenge. And if the Master won't do anything about our rotting houses, then I'll just fix mine up myself. Could you knock those crates of timber my way? Mind the holes in the floor, though, won't you? <laughs> that stuff isn't cheap. Thanks again. Oof. This supervising business is hard. I think it's time for a tea break. Where's that husband of mine when I need him? Mm-hmm. My wife's rebuilding our house. She's sent me out for more timber. But look at me. Do these arms look like they've moved anything heavier than a loaf of bread to you? If I had the fabled stone giant gloves of High Pass, perhaps. But like this? Hmm. Maybe if I gather enough matchsticks... I can't believe you actually found some stone giant gloves. I'll come clean. They're actually for me to help tidy the shed. But I'll round up some timber as well. I promise. cousin of mine. I told him not to pick a fight with those spiders in the woods, but he went and did it anyway. Now they've come and pinched him away, leaving a horrible trail of web in their wake. Please, you have to save him.
Bless my beard. You managed to rescue him. Well, thank thunder you're all right. Next time you pick a grudge, pick something that doesn't have enormous relatives living in the woods. Which reminds me. A passing elf mentioned a particularly deadly creature he was hunting. If you see him, I'm sure he could use some help. We've traveled distant shores in barrel chimney, great dumb boat. Play hide and seek once more. Fresh fish. Fresh fish. Found me, hey? Nothing gets past you. How long is this talk of dragons going to drag on for? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, you find me. trouble than they were. You found us all again, another brick to claim, a mithril prize for eagle eyes that once more won this game. <laughs> <laughs> 